these credit card companies want to know everything. Married or single? Hate that box. <laughs> Mother's maiden name. Kennedy. <laughs> Miss Fine, wasn't lying on my gold card application enough? Niles, I told you I was just trying to make you sound better. By listing my occupation as Frazier's brother? <laughs> Meanwhile, the guy won the Emmy. They upped your limit. Fran. <laughs> oh, my God, Val. Something horrible happened? <gasps> oh, God, Fran, I'm so sorry. <gasps> Somebody died? Somebody famous? Danny. Danny Thomas, Danny Kay. <gasps> Danny Bonaducci! Oh, and he was so young. Who would have thought that he would have gone before Reuben Kincaid? <laughs> Fran, I'm talking about Danny Imperiali, your ex fiance Oh, him. Well, when you gotta go, you gotta go. <laughs> he didn't die. He's getting married. No! <laughs> She was working in a bridal shop in Flushing, Queens, till her boyfriend kicked her out in one of those crushing scenes. What was she to do? Where was she to go? She was out on her fanny. So over the bridge from Flushing to the Sheffield's door, she was there to sell makeup, but the father saw more. She had style, she had flair, she was there. That's how she became the nanny. Who would have guessed that the girl we described was just exactly what the doctor prescribed? Now the father finds her beguiling. Watch out, CC. Smiling. She's the lady in red when everybody else is wearing tan. The flashy girl from Flushing, the nanny named Fran. So anyway, you didn't hear it from me, but Fran starts guessing Danny Thomas, Danny Kay, but Val meant Danny, her ex-fiance, who's worse than dead. He got engaged. <gasps> you lie. As if. <laughs> Niles, that is quite enough gossip, thank you. Sorry, sir. So who's Danny married? Heather Bibler. <gasps> no, no, the trap that stole away from Miss Fine. Mm -hmm. <laughs> but you didn't hear it from me. <laughs> Pass the cream. Oi, I'm plotting from this news. <laughs> well, this is going to destroy Miss Fine. Mm. Oh, look out, here she comes. Everyone act normal. Mm. I should serve. <laughs> Beautiful day, isn't it? Now, Miss Fine, we all know what you're going through. It's not healthy for you to keep it all bottled up inside. You've got to let it all out. Niles, you had to tell everyone? <laughs> Meanwhile, if you're so concerned about my problem, how come I don't see any stewed prunes on the table? No, no, Miss Fine, I I'm talking about your ex-fiance marrying Heather Biblo. Oh, that. I could care less. Let somebody else comb the tangles out of his back. <laughs> I'm telling you, it doesn't bother me. Oh, come on. How long have you people known me? What's the first thing I do when I'm upset? Eat a box of Malamars. Uh, rent the way we were. Uh, blame your mother. <laughs> Good answer. Good answer. Well, you see, I haven't done anything weird or bizarre or out of the ordinary. Who ordered a power drill? Oh, that would be me. Right. <laughs> Oh, yes, I am definitely getting the matching table saw for this baby. <laughs> Fran, if you're depressed, buying things won't make you happy. Oh, sweetie, you're a very wise little girl, Gracie. I'll buy you a toy. Hey, if she's happy, I'm happy. It's <laughs> fine. What on earth are you going to do with a power drill? Mm, well, I'll find some use for it. <laughs> like what? Uh, latte. Ha, ha, ha.